Did I get you? No? Okay. Mushy mushy, hey everybody, Never Ender Girl here. We are back with Fatal Frame. It's definitely been a minute, but from what I remember last, we found Yuri. Alright, let's get back into it. That's right! So we were gonna play as Rin Hojo. The Ghost Marriage. Okay, so. Rin checked the surveillance footage only to discover that Rui has also been beckoned away to the mountain. Yeah, that's right! Oh man, so much stuff happened. He recalls the dream he had after he fell asleep. Rui was inside the veiled house, aka the Watarai res residence. Rin knows this is where he must head next. Watarai, Watarai. In my dream, Rui was in that folklorist's house, the one that we searched before. I should check it out again. I might find a clue which will lead me to Rui. Head to the Veiled House. Alright! Well, this time I'm gonna look for goodies and I'm not gonna... Because I... I need some stuff. Got Rin back in his old clothes. Let's get him in the light. Let's take a good look at him. Oh, nice pants. There we go. Looking good. What's over here? Oh yeah. Gotta get ready. Woo. Okay. Ready. Camera ready. Gotta be camera ready. Rocks have blocked the road to the shrine. Maybe there's some other way through. Maybe. Maybe. What's this? I see that. So far with the story in the series, the it's really good. I love how they introduce each character. Oh. According to the map, there should be a swamp here. A swamp. Or Shrek swamp swamp. Shrek Shrek's swamp. <laughs> I couldn't say that right. Swampy swamp, hmm? Who's in my swamp? Don't be in my swamp. Don't touch my swamp. What kind of place is this? It's like a little shack? This door must be locked from the other side. The wall is falling apart. I might be able to find a way in. Okay. Well, is this where we need to go, though? Because... I don't know. <laughs> I just came in here. <laughs> it's not very big. It just looks like the room would be... a small room. Can I walk in the other side, though? Alright. That's what I want. Creepy. Did you hear that? What's with that? What's with that orange glow? I heard a frog. Oh wait, wait. there is. We're <laughs> we're by a swamp. Is this the swamp? And not very swampy. I can see a lit lantern across the water. The road to the shrine must be in that direction. Okay. Whoa. On the backside. Hey! I, I can't see when I'm like right on his back. It's so creepy. Like, I don't know if... Hold on. I don't know if some kids just don't sleep at night and they're like night owls. You know, like if you have brothers or sisters, like little brothers or sisters, or um, if you have kids yourself, sometimes the kids don't go to sleep like when they should. But it's like 11.26 p.m. right now and I hear kids outside. Either a kid or like a baby. 
I'd say about two or three years old, and I can hear him kind of like scream every now and then. And from what I know, I, I think he has um, autism. But when I'm playing a game like this, it's kind of scary. <laughs> just just a little bit to be hearing this kid screaming at night when it's like real quiet. And everybody's supposed to be asleep and stuff. So, yeah. I, I don't know if you can pick up on that, but I, I hear it. So, yeah. Adds to the scary factor. Thanks, kid. <laughs> He's only like two or three or something like that. He don't care. <laughs> He just screaming his heart out. He just having a good old time. Ooh, look at this. Ooh, let's crawl in here. But, but there's stuff over here. So, which way? Any mini. He's slow. Miney. Yeah, turn. Miney mo. <laughs> Catch a tiger by a toe. If he hollers, let him go. Any mini, miney mo. Okay, we're going this way. <laughs> There's the lantern. I'm scared. I'm scared. What? There's something shiny over there in the bushes. Something shiny here. Is something gonna pop out? Oh. Good old purifying embers. Get me nice and warm and dry from the rain. How do I get on that side, though? Oh, you can see my reflection. That is so creepy. Like right when I was walking. For those of you that don't think that this game is creepy, you try playing it at night, and you have both headphones on. Both. I have one on. <laughs> I have one on my ear, and it's still scary. And it still gives me the chilly willies. I may be a scrub. I may be a noob. But this game has really good psychological horror type uh, scariness going on. And that's my favorite kind of game. I'd rather go through a scary psychological uh, thriller type game than um, one uh, than a game that's gory because the goriness does not creep me out. The goriness is not does not phase me at all. I'm just like meh, blood, meh, brain, meh, eyeball. Don't really care. But when you throw in a I was going to say mentally challenging. <laughs> A mental challenging. Um. <laughs> yes. When you throw in a game that messes with you mentally, that's a different kind of scary right there. You know they did them job right. Them job. I can't even speak. All right, see, we're getting some goodies now. Hoo-hoo. And normally, I skip, I skip all of this, you know, because it's, eh, kind of boring. But uh, I, actually, it is, it's, it is pretty spooky. So, what was that? Oh, jeez. I'm trying to get to this thing over here. You're like, I'm lost, but I know where I'm going. I'm trying. <laughs> Alright, she won't turn around. Oh. 
Don't do that. Don't do that. Lady. those things out. Bring them out. Oh, man. Oh, man. Where you at? Where you at? There you go. Oh, yeah, yeah. Give me that. Give me that. Yeah. Oh, shoot. Here she comes. Here she comes. Here she comes. Ooh. Yeah. <laughs> Gross. <laughs> hey, what the? at the same time. Oh. Look, here it is. Okay. Got it. Whoa. Whoa, what's that? It's, a, it's like a little river. A little stream. Always give me the jilly willies every time. Cause I'm like, I know there's somebody there, but where are they? Like peeking at me somewhere? Being a creeper? I don't know, that just creeps me out the most. <laughs> Some embers. Right. Oh, look at the tiny stream. back over there. Alright. I can't. I can't see. Okay. Ooh! Right here. Good. I need more film. the shrine. Ah, uh, that's right. I think it said that, so that's what we had to do, so. Alright, so we made it to the doll shrine.
Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> the map doesn't show the location of the Veiled House. My best bet is to go through the tunnel below, the Shrine of Dolls again, and hope it appears like last time. Okay. Oh, that's right. Yes, okay. Um, this would be the door though, right? Ooh. Where's the room of dolls? Or the little shrine of dolls. Let's see. So it won't let me go through here. Aha! Right here. So. I don't like it, man. I hear somebody in my ear talking. Hey, hey, why are they up like that? Why are they up like that? Don't like it. No, no. No, no, no. Don't like it. They weren't like that last time, and we know nobody's here. What is this? Uh, Shira, uh, Shira Giru's. Wait, how do you say that? Shira Giku's journal. Journal with a white chrysanthemum emblem. This belongs to the white-haired girl. Oh, that's her name. We'll just we'll just call her Shida because Giku. I, eh. Until I am seven, I am with the gods. I am unborn. When I turn seven, I will be human. That's why I will become become a pillar before I turn seven. I am not long for this life, but if I become a pillar, I will not die. I will be an immortal flower. I will go on forever, undying. But will I be alone forever? That's right. That's so sad. Oh, these these freaking uh, ceremonies are crazy. Alright. To the womb. What is that? What, why is that even a thing? Like, is someone going to come out and get me? girl. I think Daskite means uh, help me, I think. Help. Ah, oh, they give me chili willies. It's so gross. So sad. That way.
<clears throat> All right. Is she in here in one of these boxes? This game is creepy too because when you're out in the forest, it sounds like somebody's out there with you, like walking around in one of your like ears. Just like, oh no, I did. You, you again. fast. She was too fast. Ah, okay. Alright, I'm good. No, no. Come on, woman. I'll have all day. Knock me down. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. No. I'm trying to get in my four shots. My quad shot. My quad. My quad. No, no. Uh, uh. up you big dummy stop it oh, oh. got her get her when she's down that's right stay down the same girl. Okay. Two forest outskirts. Okay. <sighs> We've made it. We found the, the vanishing house. Rui. Rui. Search for Rui. It's the tall lady. It's the tall woman. Oh, she's so creepy. Look how tall she is. Oh. Look how tall she is. Look at her. I swear, she's like from a Japanese uh, urban legend. Because the way her mouth is. Oh, it's so creepy. Didn't give me that time. I wonder who she is. And like, why she's around here. Like... Hey. Kazuya, in the hallway. Was that Kazuya? I think so.
What's that sound? It sounds like the TV's on. Again. No! 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 Oh my god, it's too late! No! 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 That's not fair. That's not fair. Oh. Oh. That was freaking. That's it. I'm using this. Cheat move sitting in two of those big guys. Ew. Can we turn this off? The old television switched on. The screen is blurred with static. I can't make anything out. Well, duh. You're not gonna turn it off? Alright. Let's just have that in our ears. That's great. The whole room is like... With black water. Yuck. A note? No! <laughs> that reminds me. One of Rui's journals. Seems she came here after all. Mr. Hojo came for me once before. He'll come for me again. I'm waiting. I will keep waiting. Waiting is all I can do. Here we go. Okay. Sorry if you hear any uh, voices. That's not part of the game. Uh, I think there's some people outside. Pretty loud. Kind of annoying. It's like at night time, you'd think it's 12 o'clock. You'd think people would shut up and be in bed. But no, they want to be outside and party. <laughs> it is the weekend, huh? Yeah. And it's like Black Friday. The weekend and whatever. I can see water through a gap in the floor. The water is black and murky. And it's hard to see past the surface. There are traces of water about, as if something was dragged out. Yeah, I don't want to be around here for that. Thanks. My shoes are all sloshy, bloshy, squash, 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 blosh. Yeah, I need some more film. I've been using a lot of it. My socks are wet. Ooh, he's wet too. Oh, look at him. He's dripping and everything. He a wet boy. He wet. Oh, well, yeah, my, my little lotus flower right there is like completely filled up. It's like, hello. I need to be dry. What's the use of getting embers if you can't dry me off? Oh, there we go. Are you, is that better? I don't know why I talked to him like that. It was weird. It's not like he's a baby. 
a big man baby. I'm just kind of trying to look through the little nook and crannies to see if there's any goodies anywhere. Goody, goody. Hey. Creepy. It's so creepy. <laughs> Don't like her at all. How tall is she? Let's go look at that window. <laughs> oh god, she's right out on the on the freaking roof. Peering down like that, all creepy and gross. Yeah. Ooh, folklorist notes. Eight. The old text found at the shrines tell of a disaster. The waters, tainted and black, flowed down the waterfalls, swelling the poles, and became a black mist that enveloped the mountain. The sun turned a muddy crimson. The border between worlds blurred. Now the waters are clear and the mists are white. It is unknown whether this disaster actually happened or whether it was passed down as a mere cautionary tale. If it really did occur, what must the locals have thought? Did the mountain rumble, appearing shrouded in black shadows? Did the river look like long strands of black hair? Did people see the black water running down the paths? The truth is unclear. What is clear is that the waters now are clean and pure. Yeah, from all the dead bodies. Hey, hey. I, I didn't ask for that. I told you to pick it up. And it's dumb because, like, the pickup action R2 is the same as the where do I go action. You know, the little little hint with the body person. Can I go in here? Oh, it's, oh, it's unlocked now. Is there anything in here? Oh. Jeez, if she appeared in that window. Oh, I, mm, I'm done. There's a pile of old text at the end of the hallway. The pages are stuck together with moisture. I can't open them. Don't you dare. Don't you dare peek in here, you peeking lady. Okay. and everything. How's my health? It's okay. I'm wet again. I heard my... <laughs> I'm sorry. I heard my socks being all wet. Okay, what is that? <gasps> Ow, my nose! Oh. There's a black box in the middle of the room. 
Dark stains mark the floor, as if something has seeped out. Yeah, that's everywhere, actually. Look at that little statue. What is it? What is it? That... Thank you. Is she in here? I think this is a good stopping point. We found Rui, but she went ahead. That freaking R. <laughs> it's not supposed to be Rui. It's supposed to be Rui. Uh, we did eventually find her. So good. But now we have to find her some more. <laughs> she pulled us in and now we're in another dimension. Uh, probably in the same house. I don't know. But this, um, this is a good place to stop. Um... Thank you so much everybody for liking my videos and watching my videos and subscribing to my channel. Um, I hope you like this series. The Fatal Frame series is really, really good. Um, I do... If you want to watch a really good series of the Fatal Frame... Uh, Mer like a... The, the Fatal Frame games from Fatal Frame all the way to 2, 3, 4 and up to this one. I do suggest you watch... Um, one of the YouTubers um, that is one of my favorites. Uh, her name is um, Gab Smolders. Um, and she does a really, really good play through of the game. She does a good thorough play. And uh, she even um, went to school for like Japanese uh, so she can speak it, write it. And she... Um, can translate some of the things in the game because she also plays it in Japanese and she'll let you know oh well, this is what they actually said and I think that's pretty cool um, if you're like really into this kind of um, game or even the series I highly suggest you go watch her play it because watching her play it is great <laughs> we're gonna have Rin just looking at us Okay, well, I hope you guys have a wonderful day, night, evening, whatever it is that you're doing. Please take care of yourself, take care of each other, and I'll see you guys on the next episode of Fatal Frame. Bye! <laughs>